In the small town of Rocky Mount, North Carolina, is where the journey began for an elite basketball player. Now standing at 6'6", the dreams of a young man is in the hands of his own. A young man of superior talent, but to others, he is under the radar. Welcome to episode one, Underrated. Sitting here in the mount, man. So tell me, tell me about growing up in the mount. I mean, it was fucking much. It's cool. It's, it basically made me, made me the person I am now. I just want to like use that to get get further and like get get out of record and get where I want to go. Yeah. Why do you want to get out of record now? So I want to keep playing basketball at, at a higher level in college and then get close. So you know, everybody knows about you know your athleticism and everything. And, uh, but I feel like you, I feel like it, you're underrated. You know, what do you, how you feel about that? I mean, I feel like I don't get as much, uh, I guess, notoriety as some, uh, some like, uh, a, lot, a lot of other players. I, I mean, I don't really worry about it because I feel like I'm better than them. Right. And I can, like, control when I'm playing. Right. What do you think, I mean, what do you think is it's going to take to get people to notice you a little more? So, so you can get that notoriety, like what do you think that they're waiting on or what do you think is holding you back for real? Um, I just say, uh, I, I just need to play with confidence and play with my best every time I step on the floor. Yeah. Things you gonna work on for next year? Uh, just shooting off the dribble and off the catch, getting quicker. What some um, what some things last year that you did well and that you think you know would drastically help your team get to the state championship for next year? That I did well. Yeah. Uh, I just say get into the basket, find the open, find the open people, and um, playing defense. But what is what about your game that uh, you you know who's looking at you right now? State, Wake Forest, Charlotte, Old Dominion, Quinnipiac, Towson, Arkansas, um, Purdue, and uh, Western Kentucky, App State, and a couple of mid majors. So you got a lot of, you got some high majors and mixed with mid majors, but you know, my opinion is, you know, we train together all the time. So I know that you're a high major prospect, but everybody might not feel that way out there. You know, what what do you think is is holding you back in your game from being a high major prospect? To the, to the to the extent of the you know getting the offers from these places like NC State and stuff like that. I say just having confidence in myself all like all around in my all around game like shoot, just shooting and everything just playing with confidence. Right, right, right. So that's something <coughs> definitely you trying to work on this yeah. summer. Yeah. Good, good. So as far as the EYBL circuit, um, you with CP3. Yeah. Um, looking forward to seeing you out there. Um, Big things you're playing with your teammate from Greenfield, Kobe White. You excited? What's what's the big thing? What do you want to accomplish this summer? Well, the big thing is I want I want to win Peach Jam, and that's that's the main goal for this summer. What about yourself personally? Like any goals you want to get at the end of the summer? Just I uh, say getting uh, some of the offers that I want, and then making the decision before the season starts. Uh, basketball is what I'm the best. Is, uh, this is what I do a lot, and I really just think I'm good. But I really I work on my game a lot. And, and I work, I work to get better, and I just want to be the best player I can be. 